you amazing beautiful people and welcome back to another attack on titan opening reaction video and today we are checking out the song counter attack mankind this has been one that you've all recommended i told you not to give me any songs that have spoilers in them or anything that's going to give away any of the show and this one all of you have said isn't going to give away anything and is one i can check out right now we checked out the original opening song for attack on titan recently and man hearing the full version of that song with the guitar solos ah oh, it just goes to show that a show as epic as attack on titan needed a song as epic as that to open it so I'm really curious to explore more of the soundtrack surrounding the show. I've only heard snippets of a lot of the songs and not the full versions. So I might have heard a snippet of this one, but I haven't heard the full version. I'm not even sure if I've even heard a snippet. I am really looking forward to hearing this along with so many other songs. So how about I stop talking? You hit that subscribe button so you never miss another video. Get us to 150,000 subscribers so you can get free Attack on Titan reactions every single week. And let's jump straight into my first time every action to Attack on Titan soundtrack, Counter Attack. Mankind. I have heard a snippet of this. I remember this in the show. I remember this in the episode. I've, I've heard this opening. I've heard this opening. But again, haven't heard the full song. It's such a beautiful opening. It really is. It gives me like Mirror's Edge kind of vibe. You know, that sort of mellow like guitar and like there's like a flute or something. It definitely like that sort of open world wonder. Like that Mirror's Edge, the soundtrack from Mirror's Edge used to give. <laughs> I'm beginning to understand this is a score. There's no singing to it. It's a score, right? It's, it's a score. Um, I don't think it needs it. <laughs> I don't think it needs it. It's rare I sit here and listen to anything that doesn't have vocals to it. And I like and I, and I won't question whether or not I should have done a reaction to it. Because a lot of the stuff I react to does have vocals in it. And we comment on the vocals. But you know what? It doesn't need it. It doesn't need it at all. This is epic. I'm literally feeling shivers go down my spine. And I'm sitting here. And it's making me realize that as someone who didn't consider themselves any a person who was ever going to like anime, didn't think anime had great music or anything like that. Someone who knew nothing about anime. Nothing. Never my whole life I ever watching or listening or doing anything to do with anime. Nothing. My brother's a big fan. That's it. I was completely clueless. So someone like me to then be listening to this, sitting here now, and we're like 10, 11 episodes into the show, and just be sitting here realizing how much I actually love this show. I've already said to my wife, we're buying season one on DVD the second I've finished it. I want to watch it with my wife. A lot of you want me to do my wife's first time reaction to the first episode on YouTube. So we're going to do that as well. But yeah, I, I fucking love the show. And I think the soundtrack just matches the epicness and incredibleness of the show. <laughs>
hoping I don't look like a crazy person for tearing up right now. I'm really hoping you guys don't think I'm absolutely insane. It's just so epic. I'm not even joking when I say this. I have got goosebumps everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. I'm downloading this song after I listen to it. I love this so much. This is incredible. <laughs> this is incredible. I love it so much. Um, I get teary-eyed and even cry sometimes at like epic scenes in movies. Um, like the ending of Avengers when they were like on your left and then the, the, the portals all opened up. Or um, when, uh, when, when flipping the Millennium Falcon turns up at the end of the most recent Star Wars and they're like, there's more of us and they look into the sky and there's a, uh, like, like those, I teared up at both of those moments. <laughs> Epicness gets me just as much as emotion as does. so brilliantly done. This is so brilliantly done. As with most scores and soundtracks, you get the first half, you get the second half. I'm, I'm a big fan of the Starship Troopers uh, score as well, and it's the same with that. So uh, here we go, leading us into the second half. Complete change, it's almost like you get two songs in one. Very different already. Completely different, absolutely completely different, and still epic in his own right with that guitar. This, I think it's like a bass. You got thundering back there. You got the drums. It's like they've just introduced a band to this orchestra. Brilliant, brilliant, <laughs> absolutely brilliant. I don't know if you guys are enjoying this reaction or anyone is watching this because it's like it's a score. It's not really a song, but damn it, I am loving it. <laughs> oh man. Japanese version of John Williams make these soundtracks because they are absolutely flawlessly incredible. so damn epic isn't it it really is it really is you just listen to this and you like you if, if you've got an, like my i feel like i've got quite an active imagination i can just go off in a daydream i can just go off in a daydream and i'm like oh the world is ending aliens are attacking and my mind just takes me there and i'm like looking out my window and I'm like ah, i see spaceships and this song's playing in the background does that make any sense do i just sound completely crazy what i just said what i mean is you just like some songs just make your mind like create a whole story 
And like, at least for me, I don't know, I don't know if I'm because I'm completely nuts. And this is doing that. I'm just sitting here in a daydream about like uh, imagining Titans, imagining the show, and playing out scenes in my head that haven't even happened. Absolutely incredible. I honestly thought going into this, this was going to be a song. I thought this was a song. I thought this was going to be like a full soundtrack song similar to what we had last time. Um, I am so looking forward to the fact that the more I get to watch of this show, the more songs I'm actually going to be able to check out as well. They're so damn good. <laughs> They're so damn good. The songs are so good. The show is so good. Everything is so good. I'm looking at my screen right now because I'm always, i always, I'm always really curious when the videos end, like what's been recommended from this one. There's a couple more Attack on Titan openings from like season two and beyond that. I won't be able to check out for a while. Uh, Darling in the Fran XX OP opening. What's that? Why is that recommended? Do you, have you got any of you watching this heard of that? Should I check that out? With all these reactions I do, by the way. All of these songs and everything, every reaction I do on this channel, I always go to the comment section to see what all of you are recommending the most. So if you've got recommendations, make sure you put them in the comment section down below because I do my best to read them all. Um, I, I, I Sometimes I can't reply to them all, but I do my best to read them all. Man! So epic! I personally, I think I prefer the first half to the second half of this score, but wow! literally just sucks you back into like you're watching the show you're just like imagining things you're imagining scenes in your head man like I, the show is getting so good at the moment so Aaron is now has this magic power i guess where he can turn into a titan at will um absolutely crazy and then like i keep thinking i'm like I, i've come up with loads of different millions of theories on twitch i always talk about my theories i tell people not to tell me if i'm right or tell me if i'm wrong not even say anything not even say I'm wrong. So I'll, I'll say a theory and I'll go, don't tell me I'm wrong. Don't tell me I'm right. This is just my theories. And I do, do that on Twitch all the time. Um, so if you guys want to be part of like our discussions on Twitch, link is in the description. Just click it, give me a follow and you'll be notified when I go live. But yeah, I love talking about the show to all of you in person. It's, it's so much fun. And uh, I'm really curious to see what happens with the basement. We've got that coming up or it might have already come out. I don't know at what point this song will be coming out in line with the reactions. Um, but yeah, it's crazy. Part of me is a little bit disappointed that Eren is actually a titan, because I was hoping that Eren was going to become the best. In my head, I was like, I want Eren to be literally the best. I want him to be, like, kicking everyone's ass. I want him to even make Mikasa look not the best. So I was kind of, like, hoping that one day he would be. But now he's a titan. I'm guessing he's just going to be kicking ass as a titan. Um, I don't know. I guess we'll see what happens. Maybe he won't be able to turn into a titan in the future. Maybe more people will be able to. Who knows? Are we going to see titan versions of everybody? <clears throat> God, I wonder who would be like the coolest looking time. <laughs> I'm just really curious, you know. I'm really curious. I'm really curious to see where we where, where the show goes with this. Because there's so many things that can happen. Because now Eren can turn into a Titan. Like, can more people turn into Titans? Are some of the other Titans that we're seeing people that have turned into Titans? Like some of them that, that seem more sentient. Like the Armor Titan, for example. That one seemed like it had a goal and a mission and it left and it didn't act like the other Titans. Maybe that one's a human Titan. It's like, I've got so many questions now. It's like the more you watch it, the more you can just start like putting together things because some things don't make sense. And then a scene will come up and it will make that thing that didn't make sense make sense. Does that make sense? <laughs> I don't know if you guys are even watching my ramblings at this point. I absolutely love this. I absolutely love this. This just shows the epicness and level of effort and love that goes into the show. The fact that the show has a soundtrack like this. Oh, I keep saying, have you guys kind of screwed me a little bit here? Because Attack on Titan is the only anime I've ever seen. It's my first introduction to the world of anime. I was an anime noob, didn't know anything about them, had no interest in watching them. All of you said, give Attack on Titan a go. So I did. I've been sucked in. I've fallen in love. So, am I ever going to like another anime as much as I like Attack on Titan? Or have I literally started at the top and now every anime I watch after this, I'll just be like, that's ah, okay. Like, that's what I'm worried about now. Am I going to watch an anime after this and like it? Has Attack on Titan spoiled me for every anime is what I'm asking. Are there any even as close to as good as it? Oh, man. Anyway, I'm, I'm going to end the video. <laughs> uh, 
Um, by the way, if you want unblurred reactions as well, I can't sadly upload them to YouTube for copyright reasons, but I do upload them all to Patreon early as well. So if you want unblurred reactions, you can go to Patreon and you can sub there. Um, I think it's like as low as a dollar a month. Um, I try and keep it really low because I don't want anyone to not be able to afford it. So yeah, if you like the unblurred reactions, that's where you can go get them. Anyway, I hope you have an absolutely incredible day in the world. In the world. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I love you. Have an awesome day. And as always, my friends, you will see me in the next video.